vectors between two points. As we saw in R2, in R3 also, vectors could be free vectors, where we are giving position of the tail and the head. And this question is related to that. Given points A as 1, 3, minus 2 and B minus 3, 1, 0, express AB as an ordered triple. Part B is determine magnitude of AB and C is determine a unit vector in the direction of vector AB. So, to find the ordered triplet between A and B, so vector AB is basically position vector position B minus A gives us the answer. So we can write this as for x values difference B minus A we are trying to do, right? So it is minus 3 minus 1. So that is the direction number along x-axis and along y it will be 1 minus 3 and along z is going to be 0 minus minus 2 and that is equal to minus 4 minus 2 and plus 2 so the vector AB can be written as minus 4 minus 2 2 as an ordered triple well this is ordered triple form right so here these are the three direction numbers minus 4 is along the x-axis minus 2 along y and 2 along z-axis this is part A now for part B determine magnitude of vector AB now, magnitude of vector AB is from this vector, we square all these direction numbers, add them up, and do the square root, and get the answer. So we get minus 4 square plus minus 2 square plus 2 square square root. And that gives us square root of 16 plus 4 plus 4. And that is square root of 24. So that gives us the magnitude of vector AB which could be written as this is 6 times 4 so I can write this as 2 square root 6 now part C is determine unit vector in the direction of AB so the unit vector in the direction of AB is actually equals to vector AB divided by the magnitude of vector AB. So that gives us the unit vector. So the vector AB for us is minus 4, minus 2 and 2. That is the order triple. When you divide this by 2 square root 6, that means multiply by 1 over 2 square root 6, you get unit vector. So you could write this as within bracket when you divide this you get minus 2 over square root 6 minus 1 over square root 6 and 1 over square root 6 so this is the unit vector in the direction of AB so I hope that you understand that if you are given a free vector with its coordinates of tail and the head how to find the vector and then given a vector in order triple form or any form for that matter the magnitude of the vector is squares sum of the squares of its direction numbers square root and unit vector is vector divided by its magnitude right since vector you know has direction and magnitude so when you divide the vector by its magnitude you get unit magnitude and it becomes a vector of one unit in the same direction as the original vector so that is how we can solve these kinds of problems thank you